Here we are at 3492 South Ocean Boulevard in Palm Beach, Florida, with the legendary rock star, real estate artist, Frank McKinney. And he says this is actually his final masterpiece. So I'm curious about that. And also, what exactly is a real estate artist? You know what, rather than me explain it to you, let me let my artist redo the talking and I'm gonna give you a personal tour. Sounds good, let's find out. Welcome home, Hot Life Miami. Oh, this is truly breathtaking. This is stunning. And what is this? So Patricia, this is the only jelly sphere in the entire world. What I wanted to do, but bring the marine life that you don't see underneath the surface of the ocean inside 3492 South Ocean in this zen-like piece of art. It's a sphere in a square. So you truly are an artist. Oh, you know, I, Patricia, I've always wanted to sing and play an instrument. Uh, this is three-dimensional art. It is? So I get to create art on a sun-drenched canvas. Really, this is my canvas, mm -hmm. known as the Atlantic Ocean, that people can live in. What better way to be an artist than create artistry that people can actually live in? You're right. Uh, I mean, I paint and I believe that art comes in all different forms and this is a true masterpiece. I can just imagine entertaining here, having fabulous dinners or romantic dinners. From a romantic candlelight, doors all the way open. We have 101 feet of glass, it's 12 foot tall, open to the ocean. So yes, candlelight, breakfast, even cereal in the morning would be exciting here. But kitchen, this is lava from France. 11,000 years old, comes out of the ground, Patricia, looking like this, a little rough, put into a kiln. We pick the color. I pick blue because of the ocean. I could pick red because of your dress. Fired on, this baked on paint finish, and you can see the little crackle finish on the top. That's the natural lava from France. Unbelievable. So even if you're a really crappy chef, this kitchen's gonna make you a real good one because look how, I mean, look, the backsplash, everything is in this blue lava. Well, this is truly a one-of-a-kind estate, and what I love about this kitchen is it's open because though I love to cook, I'm social. I want to be entertaining yeah, right. my guests at the same time when I'm making lasagna or you know a special dish, and I love the feel that the house is open so you can be involved without feeling like you're stuck you're, in the you're, kitchen. You're isolated. So, so even over here, I know you wouldn't probably do this, but even doing the dishes, if you had to do the dishes. I do the dishes. You do the dishes. Look at the view you have by doing your dishes. Wow, but I do the dishes more. Everyone's talking about your famous elevator, so could you tell me a little bit about it and how it came about? I'm so glad you asked. So this is, this is a really fun little vignette. July 20th, 1969, the United States landed on the moon for the first time. I designed the inside of the cab to replicate the inside of the Apollo 11 lunar module. It's little details like this elevator that truly make this place a work of art. Patricia, what do you think? Oh, spectacular. This whole place is just breathtaking. I want you to imagine something. Can you sit? Sure, sit okay, yes. Sit. sit, and you are waking up in the morning to that view. Wow. So we let you design the closet. You, we pay for it, part of the deal. Let me change the color of the countertops to match the bottle of champagne. Uh oh, unbelievable. I could really go for champagne in the tub. So romantic. So Patricia, we started our special tour together with that jelly sphere, and then we moved to the kitchen where we had that beautiful blue countertop imported from France, that lava. You made your lasagna. Then we went upstairs, you took the bath, we laid in bed, looked at the beautiful ocean even the Sex in the City closet, and now we end up in the rooftop lounge. 44 feet above sea level, and I'll tell you what, if Van Gogh, Renoir, or Monet could create three-dimensional art, which they didn't, this is something that they would create, and I'm so proud to have created this and so honored to have toured you through my final masterpiece. Uh, so this is what you do. You make dreams come true. And I have to say, I'm truly honored to be here with the legendary, iconic Frank McKinney. That's a true real estate rock star and artist. Well, thank you.